what similarities or differences do you see across the uh, professions of, let's say, architecture, landscape architecture, and urban design? Because sometimes I wonder, I, I understand why the distinctions between the three would be perhaps necessary, but sometimes I wonder if it's uh, kind of a ridiculous thing on, on one hand. Well, I sort of agree with the ridiculous part, mainly because I guess you know, I started off as an architect, and I'm a landscape architect, urban designer, and I come from a family of structural seismic civil engineers. So I think part of the um, opportunities is that we can that we know how to speak everyone's language, hmm. which a lot of people don't do. And so when you can talk to someone with their own words and their and understand what they're trying to tell you if you're talking to an engineer or, or even an architect it's a little closer with architecture but but basically that means of communication makes people feel more relaxed and that you understand them and that there's more opportunities to take things in different directions uh or there's more willingness to do that um and so i think when it comes across uh, it you know the, the the structure that the architect uh, is the conductor and maestro and you know godlike character mm -hmm. you know over the years has slowly worn off. There's you know and um, I think like George Harris and these other ones really challenged that these urban environments should be run by architects. Uh, and more by landscape architects. And I think because it's much easier um, to talk about uh, parks and softscapes in a, in a positive way rather than, you know, some of the monumentality and, and, and things that the profession of architecture had taken itself down uh, and gotten to. That that so a little break in the chink in the armor allowed landscape architects and urban designers to sort of break in to that world, and I think it's gotten a lot richer. So I think the mushiness or blurring of the lines on who's running what and where uh, is a good thing, and uh, I, I do think I appreciate. Uh, more characters that have crossovers on everything um, because it becomes much more refreshing. Now, do I like the one shop stop places? You know, I, I, I actually sort of disagree in some levels, like, you know, not to call any firms in LA, but they would do architecture and landscape or whatever, you know, what ends up happening is, is, is I, I do believe this, is that that dialogue, because it's under one roof, mm -hmm. one of or or both of them end up getting diminished because 